All right. Hi, guys. Welcome back to the stream. I am back with Resident Evil uh, HD Edition Remake, whatever. Um, yeah, sorry, but I couldn't stream last night. I, I had some stuff I had to take care of, but I'm back at it again tonight. I didn't get a chance to sit down and redo it. Uh, so Richard's still going to be dead. Sorry. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, is this my last game? I think it is. Fear can't kill you, bud. Ooh, seems like she's hurt. Oh yeah, Barry left me a bunch of cool items. That was really nice of him. So I'll go ahead and put that away. Um. Wait, I can't carry two. Okay, whatever. Like you can double up on bullets. I thought maybe you could double up on health sprays, but I guess not. Oh. Probably should save those for the snake. I'm sure I'm gonna have to fight at some point soon. Okay, might as well put my shotgun in there too. <sighs> Where? Oh, you know what? I should get out a health thing. started to Oops. I think it was an ear where I found the the serum for um, Richard and I was taking too long to get back to him <laughs> so I think I need to head back over there There's a crimson head somewhere, but oh, wait, can I open this? Ooh, I can. Woo! Ooh. Got more plants. There's a large scratch in this wall. It doesn't look like the work of those rotting freaks. I don't see a scratch, but I trust your observation there, Jill. 
Should I grab it? No. I can come back for those. Actually, no, I can grab it and mix it. I'll just do that. You have anything to say about this deer head? back to the hall. Oops. Oh, whoops, I forgot to put my mod on. <laughs> oh well. Oh. An unlocked case it's full of various biological reports. Oh, oops. I thought I could read that file. Oh, there we go. Fish hooks, huh? Okay. Can I read this file or what? There we go. Researchers will. A letter is slipped inside. The top part of the letter is torn off. The, re the rest of the letter is legible. Alma, I have tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts only delayed the inevitable. I am infected, and there is no cure for what, I will f what will follow, except to end my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from them. My love for you. In an hour, I'll have entered my eternal sleep where there is peace. Please understand. Please know that I'm sorry. Martin Crackhorn. That's sad. Okay. I'm not quite sure what I'll have to use a fish hook for. Gonna run into a zombie fish? <laughs> Maybe. Oh! Of course not. Okay, I guess I'm going back to my. No. I'll head back to the uh, safe room and drop off some stuff. What's in here? I got all excited. I thought that was an item box for a second. Okay, I'll come back. Hello, Kirby. It's too spooky for you. So you've never played Remake? Or are you just talking about in general with the Resident Evil titles? Oh, you have? Okay. <laughs> it looks really nice. Okay, I'm gonna put this away. And I'm gonna put this stuff away, because I don't think I'm gonna be shooting any zomb zombies anytime soon. Okay. Let's head back upstairs. Oh, okay. How you doing tonight? I've I've just pretty much started. Um, I haven't done anything important just yet. Except, you know, see this new room. And I forgot to put my door skip mod. I might just restart it so I can enact it. Given how much backtracking I have to probably do. <laughs> exactly. You know this game so well. Ooh, for aid box, sure. Do I have to open this? What's in it?
I can't open it? Alright. These footprints look like they're headed straight through the bed. Oh! Well, oh, I can open it? Oh man, maybe I'm just not... Maybe I'm just not... go. Apparently you had to open it from the, t the very top of it. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, it looks like I can move the bed then. Or... Let me make sure there's nothing over here. Oops. Oh, an ink ribbon. I'm left in a hurry. Might have to make another pit stop to the item box. Jeez. Oh, I wanted to get that, um... A jeweled insect or something. So I'll go ahead and get that, and then go back to my item box. It's very convenient that there's one right downstairs. Sounds like I'm going to be doing some fishing. I didn't know uh, Resident Evil had a fishing mini game. <laughs> sure, go ahead. Oh, nothing? Okay. Oh, no hook? Do I have to put these together? Probably. Nice. Use it on the. Use it here. Oh. Okay. Huh, I thought that would do it. No. Um... Okay. I guess let's go move the bed. This is, this seems like it's a new, a new little thing, because I don't remember some, a puzzle like this in the original. that the angle stops here. Hmm. Okay, I get that, but... Oh. Sure. Maybe I can't- oh, you know what? I bet the bed probably moves when I figure out the, um, the insect puzzle thing and the switch. Whew. Well... I still haven't observed... Okay, I'm gonna check the other rooms. Oh, 
Can you drop anything off? Oh, I'll drop off the ink ribbons. It's too bad that Jill can't seem to find out like a, a fanny pack or something like Leon could. Give her some more slots to hold stuff. Oh, I wanted to check this door. Oh, helmet, okay. Again, I wish it was marked on the map which um, keys you need to use, just like it, it did in Resident Evil 2 Remake. That was so useful. Okay, I don't think... Oops, wrong button. I think that double door might be another armor key, but I'm gonna check. I don't die. Woe to those who disturb my sleep. There's a switch here. Hell no. There's something in this depression, but the grate is in my way and you can't reach it. Is it another button? Okay, I probably do not I don't think I have anything that shape. <sighs> no. Okay. I don't know, do I have anything octagon so far? No. Right, open that room. Oh! I wonder if I can open that door down there. Let's find out. Ah! Oops, wrong button. There we go. There's my shooting button. Are you gonna come, dude? Okay, just gonna you're just gonna chill. Oh man, I just Oh, I dodged him, okay. It's back to the hall. Okay, so I guess I'll go through here and see if I can open. I, yes it is. I, I've only really played through the original PS1 version. And I played a little, a little, I didn't even get this far. Little on the original GameCube version. But, oh, that's Richard. killed Richard. <laughs> I didn't get to him in time. I feel really, really bad. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Ah! No, 
it's Crimson Head Dude. No, no, no leave him alone. Zap him. There we go. I forgot. Okay, that's where he is. <laughs> Couldn't remember what hall the Crimson Head was in. And there he was. Uh. Oh, I think. Oh, this I've been here before. Right? Yeah. Oh, like yeah, I couldn't see anything. Oh, wait. Oh, that's cool. Oh, no. Oh. <coughs> that's not cool. Man, I got bitten for nothing. Oh my god. Okay. I guess, uh, go back out here. Oh shoot. Crimson Head's here. Okay. Yeah! <laughs> he just came right at me. Leave me alone. You know what, I should probably save just in case I die, because I have a feeling I might die. <sighs> mm, no. Oh, hello dude. I'm not very good at uh, shooting the zombies in this game. I don't know if I'm not using the auto-aim correctly or what. Um. It was definitely easier taking out zombies in the Resident Evil 2 remake. Place where I can use the plant stuff is on it's in the uh, west hall, so I guess I'll just go through th towards there. Okay. Oh no, I don't want to. Okay. Dodging that guy. Too bad I can't do that with the other guys. Uh, is this the door I want to go through? No, I want to keep going. Oh! I 
think it was... Was it down there with the red doors? I guess I'll find out. I think a crimson head's in here too. somewhere. <laughs> uh. Oh, these are the crows. I think I went in the wrong door. I think I wanted the other door. Okay, so I need to go straight forward. Okay. I don't have any shotgun bullets. Oh, no, this is the puzzle room. Okay. Oh man, I just went in a circle. Is it through that door then? This is in this area. Maybe it was here. Okay, another zombie dude. Great. Let's read the Keeper's Diary while I'm being surrounded by zombies. May 9th, 1998. 
played poker with, oh, this is the, the itchy tasty note, isn't it? Played poker tonight with Scott and Elias from security and Steve from research. Steve was a big winner, but I think he was cheating, scumbag. May 10th. One of the higher ups assigned me to take care of the new creature, a new creature. It looks like a skin gorilla. Feeding instructions were to give it live animals. When I threw in a pig, the creature seemed to play with it, tearing off the pig's legs and pulling out the guts before it actually started eating. May 11th. At around 5 a.m., Scott woke me up. Scared the shit out of me, too. He was wearing a protective suit. He handed me another one and told me to put it on. Said there's been an accident in the basement lab. I just knew something like this would happen. Those bastards in research never sleep, even on holiday. May 12th. I've been wearing the damn spacesuit since yesterday. My skin's getting grimy and feels itchy all over. The goddamn dogs have been looking at me funny, so I decided not to feed them today. Screw them. I went to the infirmary because my back is all swollen and feels itchy. They put a big bandage on it and told me I didn't need to wear the suit anymore because you're already infected. All I want to do is sleep. Found another big blister on my foot this morning. I ended up dragging my foot all the way to the dog's pen. They were quiet all day, which is weird. Then I realized some of them had escaped. Maybe this is their way of getting back at me for not feeding them the last three days. If anybody finds out, I'll have my head handed to me. May 16th. Rumors going around that a researcher who tried to escape the estate last night was shot. My entire body feels hot and itchy and I'm sweating all the time now. I scratched the swelling on my arm and a piece of rotted, rotten flesh dropped off. What the hell's happening to me? May 19th. Fever gone but itchy. Today hungry and eat doggy food. May 21st. Itchy, itchy, Scott came, ugly face, so killed him. Tasty. Itchy, tasty. Uh, can I get by you guys? Yay, I did it! Ooh, liquor. Okay. Can't believe I dodged them shoot were shit, but I could dodge them at least. Uh, was this the... Okay, so... Oh, this is where the tiger's... Okay. So I know I have to find another jewel. I have the blue one, but that's it. Hmm. Oh, did she say it? Oh, nice, yes. I need all the defense items I can find. Okay, that just leads over there, so... Oh, yay, this is the room. Okay. Uh, I need to... Lid on the water pump is open. Pump the water. No. I like how she just puts the whole bag in. Doesn't even bother opening it. She's just like, Blah. Yes! Which way will you turn the switch? Oh, wait, I don't know. So, red. Oh, uh, does red go to the plant? Am I okay? I think I'll just do red then. Oh, 
Oh, lots of, um... Oh, I guess if I had used the other one, it would have killed all these plants. Okay. <sighs> oh! This is one of the masks that go in the cemetery, I believe. Cool. Is, is that it? So, where's the purpose side? Mm, still missing. The door is locked. <sighs> Can't open that door or that door yet. I guess I can just go to the cemetery then, put that mask up, down. Okay, and the elevator doesn't work. Alright, I can't do this stuff yet. This is the piano room. Okay, cool. There's something written in the corner of the picture. Commemorating the completion of the mansion. Oh, nice. Gives off a pleasant aroma like fine wine. <laughs> okay. What what's the actual What's on the- oh, it's an ink ribbon. Oh, wait. 
Ooh, yes, I will. Okay, I guess I'm playing the piano. Light Sonata. Can I open it or anything? Nice. A section of music is missing, leaving only the beginning and the end of the music. Do I have to do maybe I need to find the yeah the other piece. Okay. Did I miss anything back here? I guess I'm continuing to the graveyard. So I'm not quite sure where I need to go. If you want to come through the door, I will shoot you. Probably not, because I don't want another crimson head. I'll just have to find a way around you. No, that's too big for the other puzzle. There's not any uh, dogs lurking out there now. Wait, can I open? Oh, okay, that's still locked. room in particular is giving me flashbacks to uh, Haunting Ground with the candlelight or, or fire and the moving gears and stuff. Alright, so what did I get? I got a... Oops. Death Mask. It's a full face. without eyes. I was right, okay. Uh, shoot, I'm not sure where to go now. I guess I'll just head back towards um, the room where I got the 
hook and stuff. Maybe there was something I missed in there. Oh wait, I think there was a door I didn't go through. Okay, those ones I can't open with the key. I need to check if I can open... No, that one's locked. Because I think that's where the snake is. And that's the puzzle. Still right over there. What is in that room? I don't know. Oh, I'll just head over that way. open this one, or is it a helmet? Okay. some herbs on the porch. Well, it just looks like I'm heading back to the item box anyway, so it's probably where I need to be. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. <laughs> oh, there's like two of them. Oh no. Uh, I forgot those windows broke. I don't know if I could squeeze by them without dying. So many of them in this one room. Oh no, I made a mistake. Uh, double doors. So, note to self do not come through this hall because now there will probably be two crimson heads. <laughs> uh, okay. I gotta say, I was really surprised. I was really surprised at how often the zombies actually come through the doors. It's really a neat improvement. Oh, this puzzle. Lisa. Protected by the three spirits. A picture of a woman wearing a bracelet, a necklace, and a crown. There's a switch at the bottom of the picture. No. Okay, is there another bracelet? No. I 
title is written as follows. Bringing the light of truth to the three spirits. All right, so I guess the three spirits, one is wearing a crown, one has a bracelet, and, a, and one has a necklace. So, there's green. I don't see any. Okay, I'm just seeing red and yellow. Okay, so there's bracelet, necklace, crown. So this one has a bracelet. This one seems to have a necklace. Do I have to form the colors? Okay, so I guess once I get the correct colors under the picture, oh, well, let me just try it. Turned a deep red. Okay. Orange. White. Okay. White. Okay, I need the crown to be green. Okay, now that's the correct color. Where is the bracelet? Orange? Okay, so orange. Orange is good. All right, so now I just gotta do the necklace. I think it needs to be purple. So okay. Yay! Okay, there we go. So green, purple, orange. I think I got it. and um, pick my eyes out. Oh! I'm in the graveyard. Okay. Death mask. Sure. Okay. Let's drop this one off. This 
guy. Death mask. Without a mouth. Okay. So. This one without a mouth? Oh, no. That's all of them. Nose. Okay, I guess it's this one. I would want to continue solving that puzzle. <laughs> There's a coffin full of blood chained up to a ceiling. Maybe I just leave it alone. Okay, uh... Should I go back? Uh, uh, go that way. I have to go through the enemies. Door's locked. And I didn't check that door. Okay, well, I guess I'll go back this way then. That's right. Oh, okay. Well, oh, right. Well, at least the item box is right there. Hey! Nothing much. I... Let's see, where am I right now? I did the chemical plants. And I've set two death masks. And I just, uh... Well, I, I just opened up the... the the crow puzzle door. Yeah, I'm doing okay. Oh yeah, I wanted to save my game. That's what it's doing here. Uh, no. <laughs> I ended up not replaying, so he's still dead, unfortunately. Sorry, Richard. Oh, and I forgot to put on the door mod. <laughs> okay. So, I think I'm missing something here. I put the hook into the bug. Do I try putting the lure in that then? we go. Yes. 
Can I take anything else? something else from over here? No? Do I need to put the hook into that bee? Nope, nope. Didn't mean to do that. Gonna take the hook out. Find it with this guy. Uh, and put the B in in this thing. Let's see. Maybe if I put the golden one back in here with the other one missing, it will work. Oh, whoops. Oh! That makes sense, thank you! Didn't even think of that. And then put the bee over here. Ah, uh, that makes sense. Nice. Thank you. Ooh! Uh, uh. Man, come uh. on, Jill. Uh. Stomp it! Uh. Ooh, I know where that goes. Oh, now she stomped it. Cool! Alright. Okay, where is it? Oh, okay, it's over there. Oh no, I, I saw a, um, I opened up a door and it had a, a missing piece, so it looks like I put it there and then push the switch and not die, hopefully. Oh wait, I have to go through the crimson head. Oh well, I can do it. Oh wait, the Crimson Head's out here. It's, uh, by the stairs. Come on, guy. <sighs> this room. Oh, wait, maybe it doesn't go here. No. Dang it! Oh! Wait, where did I see another... A wind crust? Okay, maybe I don't know where this goes. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, you don't? Oh, it looked like I needed something. Oh... Uh... The sleeping night. Sleeping night. Okay, they're all sleeping. Okay. 
Okay, is there something I need to- Oh! Uh... What does this say? What are those who disturb my sleep? No. Oh, okay. Oh, here we go. Uh, so we got a shield axe. I don't know what that is. And a jousting sword? So... I push... No, I can't... Oh, do I put? Oh, do I push them into the different spots? Is that it? Can I push this guy? Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. So he goes over there, and then the shield guy goes down here. So axe, you go. Oh, I don't have the- oh. Okay, so it looks like the, um, axe and the- I don't know what that guy is holding- are pushed up, so maybe they get pushed in? So, push this guy. And... What is this of? One's a sword and one's a... That's a shield. I'm gonna say you. Um, I guess I would do that wrong. So maybe it was this guy then? Wait, can I reset? Let's see. I can't tell what that, that second part was. Okay, let's try this again. So yeah, first, with my first room, or was I, I guess it's the other... I know. Pushing. So shield in in out. Is that what it's trying to tell me to do? Oh. Hmm. What is this guy holding? He has a sword down. Okay. I don't think I'm getting... I got the first two statues right, but it, it moved away from the wall. Shield. Shield, and then that gets pushed in, and I th thought... Why is that one in red? Oh, I did. Okay. Oh, well then I'll just I'll do what I was doing before. Okay. 
to see why did he move out again? Do I push this guy now? They're supposed to pop back out again. Okay, we need to push this one. Oh, I guess that didn't work. Left and front right. Okay. Do I push this in again? Is it safe to push it? <laughs> Fingers crossed. <coughs> I'm guessing I'm dead. Oops. Okay, thanks. <laughs> the back right one, and the left one, and the front right one. Okay. Move the back right one. Then the front left one. Then the front right one. Okay, back right. I don't think I got that though. Wait. So you said the back right one. So. Oh, oh. Oh, I think I see it now. I see, okay. So, yay, I gotta solve another puzzle. Oh, goody. Design of the sun and moon? Sunshine will awaken me.
throw it on the ground, Jill. I think that will open it up. Wait, what did you say? Uh, sunlight. Sunshine will awaken me. Okay. Where is sunshine in this place? Oh, I do. I added something. Okay. Yes. Nothing happened. Yes. Oh. I push the buttons in a certain order. So I got a heart. So push the two that form a heart, I guess. Uh, yeah. Push. There we go. Cool. Okay. Yep. No, I didn't. Where... where's the key? Is it behind the tiger thing? It said there was a page missing, so I figured I had to find a page somewhere. Maybe I just wasn't hitting the piano in the right spot or something. Let me go back. I just figured it was in another room. It didn't look terribly hard. Oh, well, because I, I found this one in the piano room. So it, it is in another room? Okay. Do I only need one jewel for that tiger or two? I could have sworn I needed two. But if I only need one, I can go ahead and put that jewel. In the top. 
tiger. I think there's a crimson. Oh, I was just asking if um if that that tiger statue needs two jewels or just the one. Okay, straight ahead. Straight ahead and to the left. Upstairs on the other side of the mansion in the room where you light the candle. Oh, okay, that's way over there. Okay. Maybe because I hadn't been through that hall too often? I don't know. Okay, let me go ahead and save my game. Oh, wait. Go look for that piano page. Oh, yes, yes, thank you. Stairs on the other side of the mansion in the room. There's 
stairs near me. It's okay, I'll, I'll just do it when I get the other one. It's just locked. Oh man, you can follow me downstairs? I didn't realize that. Oh no. That's where the... Okay, let's be in that room then. There's a crimson head in the room with the stairs to the snake. <sighs> okay. I can do it. Oh, that's just that's just what's the name. Okay. Okay, I'd move this over. And yay! Thank you. Okay. I guess I should have put it together that she kept saying it was too dark in here, and I'm like, okay, do I get a flashlight? <laughs> Didn't even think about the lighter and the and the candle on the table. Is there anything else in here? I can look up. Ooh! Yeah! That's a night. Oh. And apparently shotgun shells. Anything over here? No, I just pushed that out of the out of the Okay. I see if I can make it by the crimson head without getting eaten. Ooh, whew. almost gro grabbed me. <laughs> Next time, buddy, I'm gonna have my shotgun. You're gonna be so sorry. Oh! You 
invite him more than once? Okay, so I'm gonna head back to the piano. I just thought I just thought I would fight him the one time, but oh, okay, good to know. That's good because I don't have too much like st st uh, strong ammo. I just have the sh the the shells Barry left me and the ones I just picked up. Oh, you did. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while since I played the original. <laughs> huh. I just remember how goofy it was that there was a snake in the attic. Stone in then. Oh, I went the wrong way. That's where the itchy tasty note was. Okay, I need to go get the gems. Wait, do I even have room for it? I guess it doesn't matter. you were just in leads to the piano, piano room? so I can pick up the ammo. Oh no, no, I know where this I know where the statue is cuz I ran into it a couple times. <laughs> Okay, uh, you going here? Oh, wait. Oh, this is just, oh, this is where I got the, the rifle. Okay. <clears throat> The shotgun. Why did I say rifle?
Oh, she's only a caution. Let's go back to the statue so I can get some shotgun shells. Oh, okay. I will. Hello, tiger. What? Tiger glowing blue and yellow light. Okay. Yay! Yes, I will. All right. Okay, so I did the that one. Now I'll do the piano and get the uh, oh we're getting the emblem too? Okay. I have room. So where am I? Okay, so straight down. Okay, we'll do. I like dodging because my aim is shit. <laughs> oh, wait. It's the Hello, I would like to play Moonlight Sonata. Oh yeah. The the ones where I, I fought the dog, right? <laughs> Good job, Jill. Oh, whoops, I forgot to get the other oh, no, no, no. My bad. Put it back.
Trevor's Diary. 1967. Oh, wow. This goes way back. Eleven days have passed since arriving on this estate. How did I end up like this? A guy in a lab coat brought me a meager plate of food and said, Sorry to put you through this, but it's for security reasons. That's when it hit me. It all makes sense now. There are only two people that know the secret of this mansion, Sir Spencer and myself. If they kill me, Sir Spencer will be the only person who knows the secret. But for what purpose? It doesn't matter now. It's too dangerous here. My family, I hope they are all right. I've decided to escape. Jessica, Lisa, I pray you are safe. Uh, how could I be so careless? I lost my favorite lighter, the one Jessica gave me for my birthday. Now it's going to be that much harder to escape this dark place. November 13th, the date when my fate was sealed. My aunt was hospitalized just three days before that. Jessica and Lisa said they were going to visit her. I wish I could be there with them. But wait, even as, even as I'm writing my memory, it's coming back to me more vividly. Just before I passed out, I remember the men in the lab coat said something like, Most likely your family is already... I pray for their safety. Somehow I managed to get out of that room, but getting out of this mansion won't be as easy. I have to get past all the booby traps, tiger eyes, gold up emblem. I have to try to remember for my own sake. Oh, does it sound like yeah? Got out, buddy. I have room to. Let's get the emblem. Ah, he's the guy. He's the guy that um, designed the mansion, right? So that should be pretty interesting. I have a feeling his family didn't make it. <laughs> Sixty-seven. For some reason, I thought, I thought it. I guess that makes sense for when the mansion was built. For some reason, I thought it was later than that. Whoops. And Resident Evil 7, uh, Zero established that the man mansion and umbrella have been around longer than people realize. Ah! Well, I did buy uh, uh, Resident Evil Zero as well with this, so I definitely have to play that on stream as well because I've never gone through that game. Let's 
probably the hardest of the classic style Resident Evil games. Played similar to this. The major differences being no crimson heads. Yay! Controlling two characters. Oh yeah, the no item box. Isn't it? Is isn't that the one where you have to just drop the, whatever item you're using on the ground? Oh man. Item management must be really difficult. Okay. Oh! No. Uh, no, leave. So, let me look at this picture. The short sword has been thrust into the breast of one knight. That's the right guy, while the long sword has pierced the head of the other. So... Shorts. You know what? I should just take a picture of that pit. Oh. this. I, I think I have an idea how to do this, but let's see. So the long hand through the chest, the long hands through the head. Okay. Short. Okay, yes. What does the small one do? Oops. I did not want to turn that one. Oh well. No. Yeah, yeah, I know I, f I fucked up. Good morning. How are you doing? Okay, so the long one went through the guy's head. Let's do the small. The short one went in the chest. I, oh. Small. So I do left. Oh fuck. Yes. So head and chest, right? Yay! <sighs> Woohoo! Yeah! Now we can unlock the snake. 
So let me go fill my life and I'll try to do the snake and then that will be it for tonight. Because I have to work tomorrow. Hmm, should I save it? I'll just save it here. In case I die. Because I have so many ink ribbons! Okay, those... I forget, how do I get back to that balcony? Is it upstairs? Yeah. the room again. Okay. <clears throat> Fingers crossed that the crimson hand doesn't kill me <laughs> on the way to the state room. Oh, I'm liking it! It's really cool how they updated the original game. I, I really like the stuff they've added so far. And it, it's really beautiful. It actually seems like a spooky mansion now. <laughs> Run! You miss me! So you said I can just dodge the snake. Uh, thank you. Yeah, I'll take these. I'm sorry, Richard. <laughs> I fucked myself. <laughs> That's what happened. By not saving you, I... <sighs> Can I sneak by the Crimson Head? Let's see. I'm just gonna run. I know! Wow! I know, it was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Uh, dodging is my forte, apparently. I'm sorry, man. I just got turned around in the mansion. I couldn't remember how to get to you. Uh, this way. So I might as well put the mask in, then. And then I'll save and end it for tonight. Uh, 
Oh. We're gonna get some friends. I'd really like to know what Barry's doing this entire time. Of course. Of course. Silent Hill is my jam. Yay, we got the bloody coffin. This is my... Aw, oh, man! This had to be a crimson guy, didn't it? That's not cool. Snake doesn't kill me, but this guy probably will. Apparently I got an achievement. <laughs> yes. Ooh, that probably goes in that door, that Spencer door. Is that it? All right. I do have to uh, go through Silent Hill 3 again because I gotta. I want to record a podcast about it and I want to get it fresh in my mind. So I'm thinking once I finish this game, I'll probably play through Silent Hill 3 again. So I'm try I want to try to see if I can get that recorded early September. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna go to the typewriter and save. Now I won't be able to stream tomorrow night, but I think I'll be able to stream on Saturday. I'll probably be able to play for a little longer too. And it's a, a weekend. So maybe I'll start a little bit earlier. Maybe I'll start at 8 instead of 9. Um, I'll figure it out on the day and let you guys know, but I definitely want to stream on Saturday. Wait, that's the front door. Oh, it is? That's cool. I've, uh, it's funny, I've, recently I've heard a lot of people saying that that one is their favorite. Which kind of surprised me because I figured a lot of people weren't that into it. At least, I remember when it came out, it seemed like people were disappointed. I liked it. Well, I liked, I really liked playing as Heather. She's such a cool protagonist. And, um, the game is so beautiful. It's hard, but... All right. Yay, I made some good progress tonight. Thank you again <laughs> for all of your help. Okay, so I guess I'll talk to you guys on Saturday. And I hope you guys have a wonderful Friday. And um, I'm hoping I can finish this game sometime within the next week. And then I can get started on Silent Hill 3. That seems to be a favorite of everybody's. So... <laughs> You guys have a great night. Thanks again for watching. I'll talk to you all again real soon. Night.